Hey guys, what's going on? My name is Michael, helping you get the most out of your Apple devices. And today, Apple just released iOS 12 Developer Beta 8. So this comes just two days after the release of iOS 12 Developer Beta 7. And Apple actually took away iOS 12 Beta 7 from their servers approximately two and a half hours after they released it. There was an issue when people installed iOS 12 uh, Beta 7 on their phones, how their phones were still indexing apparently, and uh, the code was trying to place everything in the right area. And whenever you tried to open an app, you would see the shadow on the app icon, but the app would actually not open. It would take about 10 to 20 seconds. I actually had this issue. I was very frustrated because usually we don't see stuff like that uh, so far along on an iOS beta such as beta seven. We might see that on beta one or beta two. So Apple did pull that release. And uh, for the people that did update, they were stuck on that release. So uh, Apple definitely wants to get this out as fast as possible for people that are running beta seven. So today we do have beta eight and the update came in on my iPhone 10 at uh, around 360 megabytes. It took about 20 minutes to install and um, performance here on my iPhone 10 is perfect. Um, since it's like only two days since they released beta seven, we're not gonna see that many changes. Um, one thing that I did forget to talk about in my beta seven video is Apple actually added back the um, the little Face ID logo in between this square here. So when it's actually scanning for Face ID, you will see that little uh, Face ID smiley face logo. Um, other than that, guys, um, if you want some more changes for this release, you can go ahead and watch my uh, Beta 7 video. But uh, performance and battery life, I can't really report on. I uh, started installing the update when it was at 100% and now it's only at 97. So one thing I did think when it was installing is my phone is actually not getting as hot because I remember when I was installing previous betas like Beta 4, Beta 5, my phone on the back got really hot and the battery life would drop like 10%. So uh, now my battery has only dropped 3% and my phone did not get very hot during installation. So that is good. Um, other than that, guys, if you have noticed any changes or any performance increases uh, with iOS 12 beta 8, tell me in the comments down below. Uh, or if I miss anything in this video, you can also tell me in the comments down below. But uh, yeah, guys, iOS 12 beta 8 is out. Uh, you can go ahead and download it now if you are on beta 7 or beta 6. I definitely would recommend it if you're on beta 7 because there might be a few other issues with beta 7 that Apple didn't tell us. So I definitely would recommend going to get this update ASAP. Uh, thanks so much for watching. My name is Michael. I'll see you in the next video.